Hi guys, I know you are looking for creating whiteboard animation video just like the one you are watching right now, then you are in the right place. I am going to show you how to create animated doodle videos just like this for your videos. So you know whiteboard animation video is the best for explainer video that will make your audience understand quickly and get more engagement. That will make your business get more sales and it also great for tutorial videos. So today we are going to create doodle video by using Creative Studio software. I tried lot of whiteboard animation software like Videoscribe, Doodly etc. That software is also good but Creative Studio software is undoubtedly incredible. You will understand in next couple of minutes why I said this software is incredible. If you not brought this software yet, seriously guys you are missing a lot of advantage in the side of video editing. By using Creative Studio, you can make 3D animation, 2D animation, character, background, text-to-speech, doodle video making, video template, custom animation, custom video editing etc. All are in one software that is called Creative Studio. I hope you understand why I said this software is incredible. So why are you waiting for? I have given a huge discount link on the description box below. You can go and grab that offer. I guarantee your money will not lose in this software. It's completely worth of your money and it's really helpful for your video editing. Okay, if you don't know how to download this software, I also made a video about how to buy and download this software. You can follow the gate to download this software, okay? Compared with Creative Studio in other doodle video making software, Creative Studio is completely user friendly and create video quickly. The main advantage is, it's an all-in-one software, you will get all the stuff for your video editing are there in Creative Studio. So you don't need any other software for your video creation. This software is enough for you. I will show you how to make high quality, professional looking animated doodle video by using this Creative Studio software. So before dive into the video, if you are new to this channel, here we talk about creating animator explainer video, animator video, tips and tricks for making professional looking videos etc. So if you are interested in this topic, make sure to subscribe this channel. This channel will help you to make high engageable videos. So without any further ado, let's dive into the video. Alright, we are in the dashboard of Create Studio. Click this create new project and type your project name. I am gonna name it to whiteboard animation and select the resolution. I am gonna select to 1080p and then select the background color. I am gonna set it to white. Then click create project now button. Then you will reach here. This is the place where you can edit your video. First I always start with voiceover then add visuals that related to the voice. Animator explainer video is all about adding visuals that based on the voiceover. That's the best method to create a great doodle video also. Before creating a great doodle video, you need a good script. Take a time and create a nice script for your video. Then use a quality mic and give a voiceover to your script. If you try to create a good voiceover or if you don't have a good microphone, don't worry that's why the text to speech technology comes into play. I'll show you how to do that. If you made a voiceover by using your mic, you can import that audio to the Creative Studio by clicking this plus icon. Click that, you can upload your audio from your computer. Or you can make a voiceover using the awesome text to speech feature that inside the Creative Studio. You don't need any other software to do text to speech. This software is enough for you. This text to speech feature inside the Creative Studio is undoubtedly amazing because you don't have any limitation. You can create unlimited voiceover using this text to speech feature. The voice of this text to speech software they are providing, it's really good. They are providing real human voices and there is no limitation. That's why I said if you have not brought this software yet, you are missing a huge advantage. I'm really shocked when I know this feature. Anyway, let's come to the working of this text-to-speech feature. You can see the little speech bubble icon. Click that and a little box will pop up. This is the text-to-speech feature that inside the Creative Studio. You can see the box. This is the place where you can add your script. And the left side, you can select the languages. They are providing many languages. I am not count that. Anyway, I think they are providing many languages. You can select the language in here and then select the voiceover artist in here, okay? Then what I'm going to do is paste my script on this box and then select the languages. I select English US then select the voiceover artist. I'm gonna select mic and then you can adjust the speed and pitch of the voice in here. So my script is a story so I reduce the speed little bit and increase the pitch. Okay then click this generate button. 
see it's done you can see the fast i'm not edit this video goes fast this is the real timing you can see how fast it is this is how you can generate the test to speech voiceover to your video using this creator studio we will make an in-depth video about this text to speech feature in this channel so you can expect that video soon in that video i will talk more about this feature okay then after generate your voiceover you can preview the voiceover by clicking this preview button or you can add this voiceover to the media by clicking this import to media library click that it will add it to the media let's close this you can see the audio is here just click that audio and drag and drop to the canvas just like this play that audio once upon a time there lived a shepherd boy who was bored watching his flock of sheep on the hill to amuse himself he shouted wolf wolf the sheep are being chased by the wolf the villagers came running to help the boy and save the sheep they found nothing and the boy just laughed looking at their angry faces then next i don't want this background as a plain white i want the background as just a paper so it's nice for doodle videos to do that what i'm going to do is i import a paper image and drag and drop it to the canvas i download this image from free pick i have given a download link on the description box below you can download it for free okay then let's come to the timeline you can see the mode click there and you can see a uh, different options click this multiply that's it and little bit reduce the opacity there we go cool right then you can add wishes that relate to your voiceover the best part of this software is you will get a good wishes that based to your voiceover inside this creator studio you can see this icon on the top of the interface click there see the different categories are available you can select devices icon illustration isometric object 3d object scene object svg object etc you can select whatever the object you want you can select in here click this icon see there are some icon category are also available you can select your icon category in here you can select color line flat style mono etc click this color line you will get this color icon and click this flat style you will get this type of icon and if you click this mono you will get this type of icon don't bother about the color of this icon you can change the color of this icon as well just go back to the home and select this illustration and you can see some category see this lined character is especially given for doodle video click the object you want i just click this see it will automatically add it to the timeline play this see there is no animation to make doodle animation what we can do is click this little arrow and you can see the doodle effect click this plus icon here you can see you can select the hand and adjust the hand size etc they are providing different type of hands you can select which hand you want you can select in here or if you don't need a hand enable this hide hand okay that's it and then play it see this is how you can add doodle effect then i'm going to show you the cool thing in this creator studio you can customize the drawing animation in doodle effect i'll show you how that will make you sense okay you can see the little settings icon click that in here you can customize the doodle effect okay in the default action this drawing is set as an automatic i'm going to change it to manual and click this edit path then hold the shift and click the object you can see the little point over there and then click another side and see a mark you can draw the path for whatever the animation you need i will show you how i want the hand to draw line that follow the path i draw like this remember guys uh, hold the shift and click to make point okay you can see the insertion if you want to remove the point hold shift plus control and click the point you want to remove see the point is removed and you can adjust the path by clicking the path and drag like this i'm going to quickly do this and i will show you after finish click this finish button and play it see cool right this is how you can add manual drawing animation in doodle effect and if you don't want this hand while playing the doodle go to the settings of the doodle effect and enable this hide hand see the hand is disappeared you can slow down the drawing speed of this doodle effect by extending this timeline 
If I extend this timeline and play it, see it's slowed down and if you reduce the size it will draw fast okay and you can import your own media as well by clicking this plus icon you can change the color of any icon image animation any graphic assets in creative studio to do that click the image you want to change the color and in the right side settings panel click this advanced and click replace color and click this new replacement and select this color drop and select the color you want to replace in the canvas and change the color like this you can adjust the tolerance saturation brightness etc this is how to change the color of icon image animation and any graphic assets in creative studio and you probably seen in my demo video i do this pan and zoom effect and i will show you how i did it this pan and zoom will make your video more professional uh, i'm going to delete this all by selecting the media and clicking that backspace to delete then i click this studio and it is a little browser in create studio you will get 2d 3d character background icon etc all are available in here i explain all this in my previous video i have given the link in the description box below you can watch that video to get better understanding about the software i'm gonna click this icon and select 2d scroll down and click this whiteboard and drag this whiteboard and drop it to the canvas just like this and i click this text icon and write something on this board and you can change the text font color etc on the right side and come to the timeline and click this little arrow and you can see the text effect and this and the plus icon click that plus icon and change this none to doodle effect and select which hand you want and adjust the size like this then you can see the camera icon click that see the pink line that's the camera node here I want the camera to start from here I'm gonna resize it to the board just like this and then fix the place that finish the writing and click this camera plus icon and this is the camera animation and I want it in here and I click this expand and then play it see this is how to make a pan and zoom camera animation in create studio you can adjust the speed of the camera by reducing and expanding this size of this camera animation just like this And you can also change the motion of the camera by clicking this curve icon there are a different type of camera motions you can preview the motion in here I just set this and play it see the camera motion is changing all the doodle video you see in my intro of this video are all made by using this create studio software it's super easy to create and you can do it quickly so thanks for watching guys if you enjoyed this video hit the like button and make sure to subscribe this channel for more great videos so see you on the another great video bye bye